This is the Collinwood House. Because of its hidden location at Collinwood Farm, few have seen it, making it even more mysterious. From this century-old portrait to an engraved stone lodged in the fireplace with the name of James H. Bell. The date, 1861, would make it the oldest home in Plano. We think it dates to the Civil War period, both in terms of its form, how it is shaped. It's what we call an eye house, and it's a form that originated in the middle of the country, um, mostly in states that start with the letter I, so Illinois, Iowa. The two-story cedar shingled farmhouse must be moved. Five years ago, the city of Plano bought the Collinwood Farm as future parkland. The old farm will be turned into a 124-acre park called Windhaven Meadows, slated to open in 2016. The house can't stay, but the Parks and Recreation Department wants to find a way to save it. So they're offering it to someone for free. But there's a catch. Whoever wants it must pay the expense of moving it to a new location. That could cost eighty to $100,000. That is a lot of work um, and, and, and a lot of expense and a lot of commitment. Um, and so the right party is going to have to demonstrate that they really have that commitment to that. Originally, the Parks Department was told the Collinwood House, named for Collin County and its wooded location, had no historic value. But the city's heritage planner, Babesh Mittal, had a different opinion. A consultant hired by the city agreed. And now, the goal is to find the house a good home, with an owner who wants to restore it and establish historic status. We really would like to keep it in the area if at all possible. The city will start taking proposals next month, and already about 20 people have shown interest. I'm Steve Stoller for the City of Plano.